I had everything set up and then it just broke. It just broke randomly. Where's my mouse? Okay. Hi. Hi. Where's my chat? Hold on. Okay. Uh yeah, no my face tracking just broke for a little bit. I I don't know why. It just did. Is my mic loud? Survive. I will survive. But it finally came back after resetting it and then typing god damn it. It finally worked. And also I have a cat cam. Cat camera. It's live. Hey baby. Hi sweetheart. I love you. I love you so much. Cat, 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 yes. But hello, how is everybody right now? Did my face tracking break again? My face tracking broke. I don't know what's happening. Uh, here, wait. Close these shades. Maybe it's getting too hot. Oh my god. Squish the fur baby. Well, I can't go over there for obvious reasons. Uh, tired as my throat has been healing. Oh. What cards are those? Are those Uno reverse cards? I can't tell. Let me make the, the chat size bigger. Uh, how about 24? It doesn't make the emotes that much bigger. God damn it. Such a hard tiny thing. Ooh woo cards? Oh, they are ooh woo cards. That's funny. Oh, hold on. I need to make sure that this is up. Is the music but oh I didn't start music, buddy. Sorry. One of the things I forgot, I had to restart for the camera. It's working. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we got it. We got it. Everything's here. Oh my god. I set up technical things today, so now I just don't know what to do with it. Um, But Grimsley, uh, your throat has been healing. Were you sick? Loading. Yeah, it's it's loading. That's a good good one. Uh, That's what my brain's like a lot of the time. But Grimsley, were you sick? And how are you, Hero Ages? Um, my face tracking broke again. <laughs> if I get a little closer, will you please, please? Okay, okay. I don't understand why it's having an issue. It's not the distance. Um, I don't know why it's having an issue. I guess it's overheating because it's been on too long. I'm not sure. Uh, so we'll see how long this goes. Uh, oh, kind of. I'm not sure in the cause, but I'm getting better, thankfully. Even if I scared my friends with my voice. It's always funny having a sick voice. You just sound so different. Thoughts are so sensitive to voice to little changes. Ooh. I gotta move again. Uh, I'm great. I spent overnight at a line for a concert. Do waiting patiently. Um, what concert was it? What were you waiting for? I need to set up my boy. Uh, I haven't gone to like a concert since like Justin Bieber. We got free tickets to uh no to no 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 um. To the Jonas Brothers. We got free tickets to the Jonas Brothers. And they're like, hey, do you want to come? And we're like, okay, sure. Because they got it from a radio show and didn't have anyone else to do it with. Uh, for Luna. And this is day two. Oh, Luna, Luna is K-pop, right? Uh, if, I, if I remember correctly, Luna is. 
some something with K-pop. Day two. Yes, it is. Ah. But reading my hand is coming up. It's not. They're behind my back. Adjust visible, invisible glasses. She's sleepy. She was cleaning herself earlier, so you don't get to see that, unfortunately. I'm gonna make some green tea soup. Okay. Is that called green tea soup? How is that different than tea? Is tea not a soup? Can you put tea in a bowl and call it soup? I finished the first concert, then walked right back to the line for day two. Oh. You put green tea over rice and place fish on it. Okay, okay, I got it. Um... It still says connect software with PC side, so I think it's going through like Wi Fi, which kind of sucks. I think it's making the the thing lag a little bit, but I'm not sure how to. I guess I can technical difficulty this. That was not that's part of the music. What if I get rid of that? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's better. That's better. It has it has a hard time harder time tracking over Wi Fi, so I got rid of the thing. Um, it still says connect it, but I think it changed, so it's a little bit better. Maybe. Uh, um. Uh, so I haven't listened to K-pop, but I did listen to like. There was one song that really, one band, and it had a guy with blue hair that was like four or five guys, and their videos were cool, but I can't remember what the name of any of them, of what it is to watch it again. And then there was a different one with a lot more people. And like, I, how do you describe video, music videos? They were in a white room and they're all wearing black. But they were dancing and I'm just like, I love these things. And these are from like middle school and I, I don't know the name of it. So I can never see it again. <laughs> I just, I don't know how to come across it. I guess if I looked, you remember the year? I want to say it's either middle school or high school, which means it's in the um, uh, 2008 to 2012 range. Oh, she's moving. It's the. 2008 to 2012 range, I would say. My glasses are falling off because I took a shower. So I'm, I'm not wet, but it's just, it comes off a little bit easier. And because I'm talking, I'm scrunching my nose up a little bit. Uh, it happens a lot more when I talk. It means these glasses are ill-fitting. Uh, it could be Super Junior. Uh, Super Junior sounds really familiar. Like, there was one specific guy with blue hair, and that was his thing. Super Junior. Sorry, sorry. Or 2 p.m., but it also be Beast. Like, Super Junior sounds very familiar. Uh, I don't know the... I can't remember the name of the bigger group, because there's one guy that I thought was really cute. And I tried to, like, track his movements, because back then I couldn't... I couldn't tell the difference. <laughs> because I just hasn't, hadn't been exposed to... uh feel different people very much uh besides besides black people i hadn't been like there weren't a lot of other people in the south it's either white or black people usually so you don't get like a good um what's it called schema schema your brain creates a schema for like when you're a child you say you have a cat and you're like cat and then you think four legged animal with fur and tail so when the little kid goes to see a dog it says cat but then it learns that a four legged uh animal with a tail can be a cat or a dog your schema imp improves the more different information that you're given 
So I just hadn't seen a lot of different Korean or Japanese people. Um, because I had watched too much anime, but not actually watched real people. I know a bit more now. Um, but again, that was like junior or middle school in fucking early late two thousands. So in in the south, because I said before that I live in Arkansas. So, in the South, there's not really a huge population. Even though we ran, we were, we went to a school that was ran by Turkish uh, teachers who just came to America and started teaching. Um, hello, this is Arkansas. Hello. Uh, Arkansas is okay, I guess. I guess. Um. Yeah, I went to a school that was just made by Turkish uh, teachers, and they had, like, a whole a whole group. Like, there was more in Texas and Oklahoma that was just a, a kind of, like, subset of schools that were just primarily taught by Turkish teachers, and I don't know what it was. Why? It just, I guess it was a way to get to America. Super Junior had a music video, sorry, sorry, that suits and black and white, but another one could be Monster X. Ah. I gotta remember these names to Google later, because I can't... My keyboard's down here, because I'm standing, so I can't really Google right now. That's what some people do, is that they go and just, uh... They're also, hi Gibby. Hi Gibby, how are you? And I, there's a, there's a live cat camera. Uh, my hands are not doing so well. Let me move this over a little bit. Cat, cat, come on. Come on, cat camera, cat camera! She's like, what are you talking about? Are you talking about me? Do you know that you're a cat? Are you aware that you're a kitty? You did grow up with uh, dogs. Uh, for the starting. Puss <laughs> Uh, When she was little, she grew up with two Cocker Spaniel Dachshund mixes. So they were small dogs, but they weren't wiener dogs. Um, and and Docker kind of looked like a, a, a Rottweiler when he was little, but then he didn't grow larger. And then Coco had was the same, but she had curly hair. I will not boop that cat. I can't go on camera. I can't go over there on camera. You have to understand. I cannot do that. I cannot boop the cat. She will get many boops later. Uh, what was I saying? Um, yeah, Gibby, how are you? Um, shut off the camera and boop. No. Well, I do have a button uh, to... Uh, no, no, no. Okay, it's not on this scene. I don't have a button to turn off the cat camera um, on this scene. I have it on the full screen. I have a button to uh, turn off the cat camera on or off, depending if she's there, and to uh, change the positioning of it. My chat's not up. I'm just looking at OBS. This is dumb. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Good. Yeah. I'm, I'm glad you're good, Gibby. Because um, you, you, you said you had COVID, didn't you? Are you feeling better uh, about that? Hopefully it was mild and didn't hurt you too much. Everybody's getting sick. It's in the middle of the summer and everyone's getting sick. Really, it shouldn't happen, but I guess it's just not what happens anymore because me and my dad had, like, some stomach bug. Two weeks of awful crap virus. Uh, yeah. Uh, still haven't got COVID yet, but I, I, I either had a stomach bug or it was a weird that I started, like, my period, but I have birth control, so it's a weird, weird. Finally got past it. Only a few small issues remain. Okay, that's good. I hope you don't have, like, any long COVID problems. I think those are rarer with the new strain and being vaccinated and stuff. Because I know some people who got it in, like, who got COVID in, like, the two, in 2020 who survived have, like, 
really bad issues. My forehead is is flaking. I have um psoriasis. So I uh it's on my forehead that my skin's flaking off. So I have some uh petroleum jelly that I'm putting on it right now because I can't stop doing it and it gets into my glasses. It's not very attractive, but you know, that's just how it goes. But yeah, hopefully no big issues remain. Because it reminds me of a, like when I had um shingles. I had shingles and it burned for a little while longer afterwards and I was really hoping hoping that it wasn't like uh, what I've heard before is that some people who get shingles it just lasts forever it just it, it just keeps going it still hurts occasionally just at random times usually the, the rash isn't there but the pain is still there and that's like really not nice and not cool I don't like that at all um uh, I haven't gotten my shingles vaccine because I need to talk to my insurance because you're not supposed to get the shingles va oh oh you're not supposed to get the shingles vaccine until you're um like 65 or something because that's when it usually crops up but uh I got it when I was 30. I got it the week of my birthday of turning 30. <laughs> um so I have to call insurance to be like, "Hey, I had it, so please pay for the shot because the shot itself is like three hundred dollars if you don't um have insurance to pay for you, and I hate calling people, so I just haven't done that, so I have the uh possibility to get shingles at any point in time again because it is a reoccurring thing that can just happen it usually happens with stress um I'm surprised how expresso depresso I was. Um, a few months ago that I didn't come up. I was really stressed. That's surprising. Uh, hopefully I just don't ever get it again, but I do need to get the vaccine. And the vaccine is better now. I think it lasts for, like, at least six to eight years. Or I think it's only been out for, like, four years, so they don't even know how long it lasts. Um... But that was longer than the other one that lasted for, like, two years and was only, like, I want to say, like, 75% effective. Uh, but that was the only vaccine they had. But uh, they have a new one. So I have to get that. It's not in my primary care uh, office. I have to go to, like, a CVS or something, or I have to go to a drug uh pharmacy hello royal knight vt hello thank you for following we're talking about shingles how i had shingles when i was 30. hello hello how are you um this is a live cat camera oh no oh because the shingles uh but if i can get my hand this is a live cat camera this is my little kitty hey baby I just have to prove it. And she's like, why are, you, why are you talking like this? Why are you doing this? I have to prove that, it, uh, uh, <laughs> that it's live. Um, yeah, that was last year. Oh, yeah. Because I, I realized I have, like, an iPhone 6 when we're, like, on 13 now. Um, and I'm like, can I use this as, like, a camera? Because I have a small camera mount. It came with something else, um, and I figured out that you could use Droid Cam because I know that Dai Shima VT uses Droid Cam for uh, his T setup, and he uses like a di a different phone, like a and another Android, I think. So I assumed because it's called Droid Cam, it was only for Android, but no, they have a iOS version, so I could use my old iPhone six. Uh, it's just that it has to be plugged in all the time, because if not, it will die within a few hours. <laughs> so it's plugged into the computer. Um, I don't think it's being sent through Wi-Fi. I'm not exactly sure how it works, because a lot of times you can put in the i 
honestly, the only way to use it correctly. Oh, to use the old iPhone? Yeah, just cat cam. And that's only if she is uh, in the bed. Sometimes she really hates when I talk and talk to other people. So she just runs away. But right now she's pretty, she's pretty chilled out. Um, well, she's a little not chilled out. Oh, no. Literally, as I said it, she's leaving. No, my precious baby. My baby. Where are you going? Baby. I love you. I love you. Where are you going? Baby. You're just standing there. What's happening? What are you doing? Oh. She's just sitting on the floor. I talked too much about her. Uh, she's just sitting on the floor. So I'm not sure what she wants. I guess it's because I called to her. What do you want, sweetheart? What do you want the most in your life? I'll give it to you. I'll give anything to you. I keep breaking if I look at her. Oh, she's going to leave her cat door. Okay, so... <sighs> Sadly, that is the end of the cat camera. Uh... Until she comes back. I'll leave the droid cam on. Uh, I don't want to reset it up. Because the only um issue with droid cam is that... Is the issue with any web, uh, web capture or video capture device is that there is a chance if it's not working correctly when you try to open up, it freezes OBS itself. Or at least those are the issues I had. So it's not cool <laughs> when that happens because you'll lose your stream so you can't change it midstream or else death. So it's set up now. It's going to sit there and be on until... Um, until she decides to come back. Why are you staring at the... She's just sitting there at the cat door and didn't want to go out. I wonder if she's waiting for, like, Lacey. Because the other cat can come in here, too. My mom's cat. She can also come in here, but... She is not currently. She hasn't been spending as much time with me lately. Um, uh, I have a throne and I have a cat bed. Uh, I had, like four different cat beds listed on throne and then they took them all off so i have a mini dosh hound bed um full disclosure she already has a cat bed i just want to have want her to have another one and also a knife because i wanted a knife um i don't expect anyone to actually buy anything for my throne but i still have it there just just in case someone feels generous because. That's the only way people know. That's just how it is. But yeah, Nolly, my kitty, she she is shy. She's she's shy around people. She knows when a camera is on her. Sometimes she doesn't care, and sometimes she models, and she's beautiful. She's just a beautiful baby cat. Um. And. Yeah. But some, but sometimes she knows the camera's on her, and she doesn't want it, and she doesn't want me to talk. The only thing she wants in life is for me to lay down with her and just lay down with her and pet her. Nothing else. No working. No computer. Just lay down with me. And she is um simple needs, very simple needs. But she is thirteen. I think she'll turn fourteen. This month, I think, is when we got her. She'll turn 14 years old. Um, so I try to be as nice to her as possible because she loves me. She's, she's my cat. I took her to college and everyone else. She, she likes other people, too, like certain other people. But, like, if a random person comes into the room, she's probably just going to leave. <laughs> she's just going to be like, no. And she will not, absolutely not, uh, go out when there's, like, company outside, uh, in the house. She'll just leave, go into the room, uh, cause I, we made a cat door in the, we, we took a cat, we bought a cat door, which is supposed to go, like, on doors to go outside, and it's just on my door inside the house, so she can come in and out and not have to scratch at my door and annoy me. But sometimes she gets weird about it. Like, she doesn't want to go through the door. And it's just like, 
You know how to do this. I hope you don't have Kitty Alzheimer and you just forget to go through the door. But she's a, she's a good girl. Oh, drink a little bit of V8. V8 diet energy. I'm sorry, V8 plus diet energy. That's a long name. Uh, it's diet, so there's no sugar. It was tasting bad earlier because I brushed my teeth. But it is now not as bad. And I'm still standing, even though one foot is getting a little tired of it. Because I need to... I had a lot of mobility issues uh, last year. Ow. And the starting of this year, I've had a lot of mobility issues. Um, and I've been losing weight. Uh, I am... Math in my head. I think I'm like 20 pounds off losing 100 pounds since last year. If I lose 20 pounds by September, I will have lost 100 pounds in a year. Um, uh, so I've been doing a little bit more exercise because I have a medicine that um, helps with it as well. And uh, I'm trying to pair that with exercise because for a while it was stalling. When I first was on it, it just everything melted away but at the at the high point of how much i weighed i was i also have um degenerative disc disease so my spine isn't good so just like sitting in the chair for a while kind of hurt but uh i've gotten a lot more mobile and then i started doing ring fit which i hadn't streamed in a while because i could i actually had a little thing where i could string ring fit and it tracked my hands and my face a little bit um using the same webcam, and uh, I realized that I can sit uh, in my chair longer without feeling achy when I exercise more. I know that's a dumb reason to exercise, is like, I can stream for longer if I, if I exercise so I, can, so I can sit for longer. That seems like a dumb reason, but it's, like you said, small goals. Um, so, it used to be that I couldn't stand for more than five minutes, and it is now 36 minutes, and we had, like, seven minutes of technical difficulties because my face tracking kept uh, dying. I think it's currently quite, it's lagged a little bit, but uh, it was stopping and starting, and it, it's, it's already not happy. It still says connect with software on the PC side, even though it's still working. Um... Now I'm just kind of moving back and forth. That's what happens if I stand in place too long. Is that I'll just... I start going back and back. You have not seen the new model of yours yet. Low poly is such a cool idea. Uh, I really like it. Um, I think I'm hitting the point where it's like... Mid poly? <laughs> if you want to call it that. Mid poly? It's mostly low poly and it's like a simple cell shaded style. Um, but... This mouth got really complex, and I still have to redo the tongue because it's not working. Um, I'm having to make things more complex to get them to work in BRM. But the goal was low poly. It was. this. My hair is just a bunch of cylinders put together. <laughs> They're different things. Uh, it looks really good because of Magicka cloth. Uh, which is a uni program, and it can run in VC face only. Unfortunately, it can't run in like normal VRM, like VR chat, things like that. Are your fingers glued together? No, my fingers are not glued together. I got fingers. I got a gem on my finger. I'm an alchemist, and a gem right there. Um. Uh, yeah. I can't. I can't do this while I'm playing intensive games. Because the tracking, the webcam tracking for the hands, uh, is another Unity program open. Um, uh, love the pop-up chat on screen. Thank you! I coded it, uh, I'm not going to say it myself because I did it through Stream Elements, but I didn't have a base. I coded it in Stream Elements using their API that connects to Twitch. Because I didn't do a Twitch token and make my own chat, but I did, uh, code from scratch the 
the what happens with the API calls and stuff like that. I still haven't fixed when someone doesn't have a uh, hi Lacey, there's a different cat. Maybe she'll lay down. Um I haven't fixed when someone has a uh they haven't picked a username color. It just shows up black and then the outline is also black. So there's a few things I still need to fix. I'm going to uh, redo all my alerts at some point in time, but not right now. You'll get there, yeah. There's just, I, I don't want to say I half-ass things because I don't. I put as much effort as I can into it, but like, I'm not a perfectionist. There's a point at which I say, you know, good enough. Let's do this. Because this is like version 1.2 of the model, I would say, because I didn't do a lot of different um, lip movements because I thought it really didn't matter in the end. It would look weird for a low poly model, but then I realized I really do want like that face. And then I learned with um, with uh, the program iFacial, uh, iFacial MoCap, uh, I can like set the thing because before my brows wouldn't move. So I just put the weight really down so I can move my eyebrows and stuff. Uh, so this face is more expressive than I actually am. Like my actual real face. Uh, this face is more expressive, which is kind of funny. And also, I'm sorry, Grand Cross Age, you missed the cat cam. Uh, I did have a uh, cat cam with a little kitty on the bed, but, uh, but she, uh, she left. The other cat, um, I don't want to break my tracking. Try and look for the side. Uh, is she in the thing? Nope, other cat just came and left. She decided she didn't want any part of this. I want her to lay down. I mean, I, I can't open the window. Cat cam? Oh man, yeah. Um, she was being so good, and then we were complimenting her, so she left. Um. Uh. Oh, I can open the window. She didn't want to be low poly. No, she's not low poly. She's she real. She's a real kitty baby. Cause I can show you like um, this is where she was. She was laying on my bed. Um, I have a little thing for it, but she decided to leave. Uh, but if she comes back, uh, we can turn it back on. Or if my mom's cat decides to lay down, we can turn it back on. But she just ran around my um. My leg, she just wants some attention, which I can't give her right now because I have to go very far down to pet her. Because I'm standing to try and put my stamina up from standing and just, you know, talk about stuff. Oh, fuck. Uh, I have the the key because I, I gonna, I'm going to stream Growbot today. So I have that on my timers because you need to disclose that you were given a key. Um, so... I need to, uh, I don't think I'll be on long enough to, that I need to turn it off. Um, I realize I'm missing a space though. Uh, yeah, I've been using Keymailer, uh, only for games that I'm interested in. That I'm like, this looks kind of neat. Let's ask for a key. And, uh, a few of them have given it to me. Because I think the last thing I streamed was, uh, no, it was art. But before that it was EX Zodiac, which is... Dark Souls Fire so uh, uh, Star Fox. And that was uh, difficult, and I could not get past the, the first level, but I was very close. There was just one type of thing that I couldn't do it. Also, I didn't ask Grand Cross Age, um, how are you doing? How's, how's your day been? Uh, I always forget to ask people that. <laughs> they just pop in. I'm like, yep, I'll just talk. Instead of just saying, hey, how are you doing? I do the same thing in DMs as well. I just... I... Uh, fire in with a meme or a thought. I don't say, hi, how are you doing today? I don't, I don't ask that because I don't know, I'm weird. And it's good you're doing good. Where are these emotes from? Let me scroll over them. Oh, they're pixel emotes. They're very cute. Who, who did those? Who did those emotes? I really like them. I really like the style. Ah. His name is Pooh. Uh, would he... Is it in your, like, about listed somewhere?
I can make noises. Uh, cause let me just Baron Bon Fu on Twitter. Uh, here, let me just do that and then copy this. Maybe, and then maybe I'll eventually remember. I I go I go back through my vods and watch them quite often actually. Actually, I can put a stream marker here, just for me to remember. There we go. I got a stream deck. Uh, they just finished my backgrounds last week. Nice. I uh I had a background. Uh, that one was kind of half-assed as well, like because I was just tired of it. So I did like a filtering on like a proto 3D model, like it was meant for like D and D. Um, uh, not telling our partners so I rely on them a lot. Uh, I'm an artist, so I, I did everything you see on screen. Uh, uh, this is my first model that I've made, like a humanoid model. So I'm still tweaking so many different things because I'm going to make one for my sister, but I, I need to make sure, because I think the hands are like too big. Because I'm trying to tr uh, transfer into VRM format, and VRM format, um, like it, it thinks the hands are too big, so I, I may have to change that. And the wrist movement is like, can I get this to work? It's kind of strange. Um, I've got to get it at work. Let's see if your hands are bigger than your face. You have cancer. Uh, maybe, maybe they're a little big. <laughs> Uh, they were even bigger for, at first. Smacked at the head. Uh, I, uh, yeah, I started big because when I do pixel art, because I also do pixel art, which is why I was really interested in your emotes. Um, I got them. <laughs> uh, when I do pixel art, I tend to make hands bigger because I just like more detailed hands. Um, so in my mind, the hands were appropriate sized and then trying to actually convert it to VRM, they're like, no, your hands are too big. And I'm just like, why? Let me do what I want. <laughs> but VRM is like a standardized format, so you have to play with their rules. Um, at worst, uh, I've been practicing my pixel art. Uh, it's nothing like food does, but I can feel myself improving at least. That's good. Uh, it takes time. It takes a lot of time. Uh, pixel art usually um, is a little bit easier to get into. It's weird. It's both harder and easier to get into. A lot of people are scared of it, but then it's also very accessible because you can make mistakes and they don't seem like mistakes, I guess. Um, uh, what was I going to say? Uh, there are a lot of things that can be made up for because it's such a small scale. I have no art background, so learning the basics of art have been challenged. Yes. I went to fancy art college, and uh, I shouldn't have because that was really way too expensive, and we have college debt, student loans coming back up. Color theory and anatomy. I'm not good at anatomy, so I have to... This is why the hands are big. Um, I have to look at other things and then remove a lot of things because it's just not right like I'll make torsos too big and stuff like that even though I took three life drawing class classes um color theory uh where's my music your hands are that big well it, they were bigger video pause continue watching yes your butt all right let's get this back up um Put my hair back because I took a shower, so it's all like wet. Uh, what was I gonna say? Color theory, I've always been like, I'm not gonna say I'm good at it, like really super good at colors, but like it makes a lot of sense to me. Um, I enjoy the program Pixel Edit because it auto, um, my face tracking. Okay, my face tracking broke for a second. Uh, I like the program Pixel Edit, uh, because it when you pick colors, it has automatic suggestions on the sidebar of like uh, shading based on hue, uh, hue shifting and uh, other things like that as well. It's really good. Um, 
but it's a very fringe program. Not a lot of people use it. And uh, I've been using it for like six or seven years uh, through its development. It hasn't updated in quite a while. Um, the only thing that I think I would want would be a lasso tool. Everything else is perfect. The way it's tiled, I really like it. Um, I really like that. Yeah, Q shifting. Q shifting is really good. Um, interestingly, in this model, nothing is Q shifted. Like if you see everything that I'm that I have, nothing is Q shifted because I just wanted like a. I don't know. There was a different look that I was going to. This look and digital art is very different than what I usually did. I have a sprite. Um. I just, I don't like the layout of a sprite and they do their own things with keys like, um, like Clip Paint Studio and Affinity Photo and Photoshop all have like standardized keys like E is eraser, B is brush, uh, uh, something else is, uh, to deselect or shift D to deselect, um, uh, middle mouse or space to pan, things like that. A sprite doesn't do that. A sprite does its own thing and has things in weird spots and has like 500 fucking menus. Um, Marma said hex holes. I, I did get it for through a free bundle and I just, uh, it wasn't for me, but I, I do have it actually. It's still on Steam. Um, it was kind of fun. It was an interesting program. Uh, but I don't think a lot of people make a lot of art in it. Uh, it's just kind of a neat, interesting. Uh, a niche? 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 Uh, I need more water. Ugh. It's It's different. It's kind of cool, though. So, uh, I don't know if you were here when I was talking about how I have, like, mobility issues, so I'm standing right now to try and stand for a while. So I've been standing for about 40 minutes. Uh, I don't know when I should cut it off, because people have been coming in and talking, which is nice. Uh, you never want to, like, leave when people are coming in and talking. But at the same time, I'm just like, my feet hurt, and this the point of this is that I'm standing up. <laughs> Don't skip leg day. Yeah, I, I did some squats this morning as well. I've been trying to do more exercises because I can sit longer in my chair if I do exercises. Uh, it makes my back better if I stretch it. Weird concept. If you stretch your back, it makes it more flexible and you can do more flexible things with it. Weird concept. But yeah, it's just it was hard for me to get into the habit. Uh, but now when I make my breakfast sandwich in the morning, I do squats as I, as it has, it has a, um, a defrost for like one minute and 20 seconds. So I, uh, put my feet up on like the edge of the kitchen counter and stretch that and then do both legs. And then the 45 seconds of actual cook time, I try to do 10 squats. That's what I've been trying to do for the last week. So hopefully I can get a much more better core because I've got back uh, disease issues. So it's good for me. I'm getting hot. I don't know why I'm getting hot. The exercise, I want to do swimming because swimming is fun. It works out a lot. See, the, the thing is, is that I used to, because I was very fat, I, I am still fat, but, um, before I could be mobile enough because I was having serious mobility issues, like had to use the the sad electric scooter at Walmart issues. Um, I did aqua therapy, but with health insurance, you only have a limited amount of uh, physical therapy appointments that you can have. So I can't swim as much as I want to. But uh, now I've decided to not do aqua therapy because I can do exercises on my own now. And just do normal, uh, it's, it's physical therapy and chiropractic together. Uh, 
so they do a lot of other stuff um and do some exercises as well but just they have a pool for aqua therapy uh that really helped for a while but now i need to like manage my appointments to not take up too many uh because i don't know how many i have left in this year just want to get a gym membership at this one gym in town that has a pool and swim laughs a bunch like i really wanted to do that too like but the community pool was like eighty dollars i think a month i don't remember if it was a year or a month if it's a year eighty dollars would be fine but it's, it was worded like it was a month like an eighty dollar membership a month to have all the the stuff and go to the pool and i was like i don't think that doesn't sound right um and a lot of the other gyms are all uh uh predatory. Gym for this membership is like it hopefully it's not Planet Planet Fitness because Planet Fitness you have to go in person or you have to write a letter saying that you can't go or something. Um to cancel. They just won't let you just call and cancel. The peak. Okay. But uh and then Planet Fitness every once in a while will send me an email and we'll be like, hey, you want to come back? I'm like, shh, get me off your fucking mailing list. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Because at the very least, because we did try a different membership, me and my sister, um, and we signed a contract for a year. And then my sister lost their job. Uh, so we were like, hey, can we cancel it? And they're like, no, absolutely not. And she's like, I, we can't pay it. I lost lost the job and they're like no no so i haven't had a great track record with gyms and i'm a, kind of a hermit i don't like going outside and i don't like going outside alone uh so it's not great uh the idea of going to a gym is not great i wish i had like a biking thing uh they're refurbishing the, their pools. Just looked it up. Oh, nice. That's good. That's good if they have the uh, if they have pools. But um, uh, I just wish we had like room and also a uh, I guess a bicycle thing, like the standing bicycles, because I was told that treadmills are not good for me. They're not a um, they're not a, whatchamacallit, they're not, if you have back problems, like, the treadmills kind of, like, put a lot of pressure on your knees, like, I'm walking right now, uh, they put a lot of pressure on your knees and kind of move your back in weird ways, so they recommend, like, cycling more than they do, um, being on a treadmill. Uh, a heated pool, a lap pool, and a hot tub, I don't know the difference between a heated pool and a lap pool. Also, I don't, like, the pool that we went to was heated, which, it was heated for, I guess, sanitary reasons to, um, keep germs down and because heat is healing because this was a physical therapy place. Um, so it would be that, but I don't know why a lap pool would be something different. But I don't know a lot about gyms. My hair's bothering me, so I'm about to stick it in my... And an actual ponytail and be like my character. My hair's almost that long too. Did my face okay, my face. I was a little bit too far from the thing. The iPhone's like, no, you're too far. Okay. Woo. Yeah, so I'm a little wary of gyms. Uh just had bad experiences with them. But it would be nice. It's just I don't know how to use the equipment and the trainers are expensive. So I'm just like, this is weird. So I try to do the most just, like, doing stuff at home. Uh, which is good. That's my level, because I only have, like, three pound weights. I had five pound weights from college, and it was too much for me to, like, do the full set of arm uh, uh, exercises. And I'm like, I have to admit defeat and go down to three, three pounds. I'd rather just look at what exercises do than see a trainer. Yeah, you gotta look at the machine and then, like, YouTube. How do I use the machine? I'm pudgy and I don't want to be judged by them. Yeah. Like, you would think that... That they'd be nice because you're trying to not be pudgy, but... 
the feeling that people are looking at you is a problem that I have um, in general in life. The paranoia that someone's looking at you. So, that everyone's looking at you. So, gyms are, are, not, are not the greatest. But, uh, I may wrap up when we hit an hour because... My feet don't hurt too bad. I could stand longer if I had to, but like the what's the ankle? <laughs> my ankles uh well my my right foot has a little more issues than the other one, so the actual right foot and the ankle are like getting a little numb. The left foot's fine, but my right foot has like some type of circulation issue compared to the other one and swells sometimes. Uh so I will have to wrap up eventually. Ugh. Ugh. And I'm also getting hot. I don't know why. I just because I took a shower. I took a shower and I'm hot. And then also now I'm just talking and standing and like exerting energy by standing, which seems really sad to be on an exercise level while standing exerts yourself. But that's what my life is. Uh, yeah, that's what my life is. It's getting better. I'm working on it. This is this is improvement. This is improvement. I oh, <laughs> that kind of works. Improvement. Improvement. Does that work? Why are they together? Ah, ah, ah. One hand. This one. This one's better. No, it's bad. It looks bad with the wrist. Uh. I can't do a good thumbs up. I have to change my rigging a little bit and with the way my wrists move. <laughs> Cause I can't thumbs up. But uh yeah. So I am going to raid y'all over to no one's online. Um that just means I go to Twitch and find somebody. Do you have a suggestion? Also, I'm taking commissions, by the way. I am taking pixel art commissions, uh, if you're interested in that. Uh, I have a bunch of stuff on my, uh, 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 whatchamacallit, on my website. I have a bunch of examples on my website, and it's got all my socials on it, too. Um, uh, VTuber, and sort by... Viewers high to low. Wait, why can't I do viewers low to high? I'm just going to scroll down really far. Look, there's me. All right. We are just going to braid some random. Grayler is Pixar. They're live. Oh, great. Okay, Grayler. Let me, let me look for that, actually. No, I think they're talking. Stop, stop. Trailer. Uh. Okay. So let's do. Uh, okay. All right, so I'm going to go to transition screen. Uh, oh, the live cat cam. I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, check out my site, missnina.space, and I hope to see you guys later. Bye!